Hey everybody, uh, I want to make this YouTube video to show my latest project I just finished today. Uh, did it with my youngest boy, my youngest son Josh, he helped me out on it and uh, we just got finished with it today so I thought we'd do this video to show everybody what we got. What it is is a 22 disc, 20 inch diameter disc carrier. Uh, I was in the market to buy one a while back and as I got to shopping around and looking at them and pricing them realized they were more than what I was willing to pay for one so I just decided to build my own uh, bought some steel locally here and uh, came up with some dimensions I thought would probably work and uh, just cut it out and started welding uh, what we have here is on the front it's uh it's got 10 discs across the front they're on they're spaced at nine inches apart and they're scalloped discs. They, they'll cut the ground uh, rather aggressively. And then on the back here, there's uh, 12 discs. And they're spaced at seven and a half inches apart. And they're smooth discs. And they should cut the ground a little finer and grind it up a little, little bit better than the front disc after the front has, has cut it in bigger clumps. And also what we did was uh, we adjusted, put, put this adjustable bracket in here where you can adjust the pitch of the gangs to make it cut more or less aggressively. You just uh, pull them forward or backwards, high, whichever way you want it to cut, and put your pin in there and it locks it in place, which that's pretty standard on, on a lot of Harris. Uh, this thing is built out of three inch square tubing, three by three by quarter inch tubing. Uh, these gang tubes, are made out of three by four by quarter inch tubing uh, and all the side plates and the hitch plates and all, all, all of that's made out of half inch plate. So we're curious to see how this thing's going to do. I'm hoping it'll do a good job. Uh, <clears throat> also I got most of my parts from Agri Supply. They, they had everything I needed as far as the disc, all the spacers and the bearings and the axles. And, uh, I thought they were reasonably priced also. So hopefully it'll, it'll, it'll do what I'm expecting it to do. Hope to try it out in the next few days. But the one thing that, are, that are, I'm really most proud of on this piece of equipment is the, the name we put on it. Uh, that, that's my dad's name. He passed away back in March. And uh, he taught me everything I know about farming and gardening and tractors and that kind of stuff and uh, he, he always liked to garden farm and so I thought it'd be a fitting thing to do would be to put his name on this piece of equipment so if you would leave me your comments what you think about it uh, or you can send me an email dflender28 at yahoo.com and thanks for looking